Hey everybody, welcome to the channel. We're out here in the shop today getting ready to start a new project. I've actually got to carve a set of moose antlers. Now instead of just picking a log and uh, going at it with the chainsaws, I decided we're going to carve this set out of dimensional lumber. So what that means is we're going to be cutting these pieces down, gluing them up, and then we'll be carving things away, moving into sanding and airbrushing and all that kind of stuff. Now, you guys are going to be able to watch that in time lapse. I got a feeling it's going to take several hours, a few days kind of thing to get this to a, a, a final product. But hopefully you guys will stick through the whole video. Be sure to give me a thumbs up. Leave me a comment. Hit subscribe. Hit that bell. Hit all. Make sure you guys YouTube notifications are on so you don't miss those future uploads. And uh, let's get started. Everybody check it out. Thought I'd slow it down so you guys could take a look. We got this bottom here kind of blocked out, gluing pieces up, getting ready to use the jigsaw to cut these upper pieces out and then we'll move into some carving. Now is a great time though to give me a thumbs up. Let me know what you guys think so far. Hit subscribe if you haven't already. When you do hit that bell, hit all. Make sure YouTube notifications are on. And hey, if you're already subscribed, you guys can go back and do some of those other things. Turning the bell on, hitting all, making sure YouTube notifications are on. It seriously helps the channel grow and I really do appreciate it. Listen, if you guys like my work, you like following me, or maybe this is your first piece, just thought I'd let you guys know I'm gonna be carving live. Yes, I'll be carving live Saratoga Springs City Center it's uh, 522 Broadway, Saratoga Springs, New York, March 25th and 26th. Now, I'm pretty sure I'm going to carve the 25th. The 26th is a possibility, all right? This is 2023 in case this video makes it in a few years. But just figured I'd let you guys know there is an entrance fee of $15 per adult. And children that are 12 and under are free. Now, I believe they take cash and they might take card. I don't, I, I think they take card now too, but it's a really great woodworking event. There's all kinds of, uh, you know, hand carving, bowl turners. There's a lot of uh, furniture on display, things like that. But I will be there with 
the battery saws, possibly some power tools. We'll be creating some stuff right on site indoors and uh, hopefully I'll be able to see you guys there. So if you see this video and you decide to make it, I'd love to know that uh, this video is what directed you to that show to uh, see me in person. So hopefully I'll see you guys there. Now, I think uh, we're gonna go back to high speed. We're gonna bust out the jigsaw, get these things cut out and uh, get right into carving. So don't go anywhere guys, it's gonna be a lot of fun. So we've been working on these moose antlers. We were just outside carving them up in that last little segment there. And now I've got them mounted inside. Now, since that last video, I finished up sanding. The GoPros went dead, but we finished up sanding and detailing. All right. They have been sprayed with a uh, second here. Grab it. Ugh, they've been sprayed with a primer. First with a white and then this off-white tan kind of color. And now what I'm going to be doing is using a Pache single action airbrush and some water-based paint. Just the stuff you can get like right at Walmart, Apple Barrel, diluted in water. And we're going to start airbrushing details. So I'm going to try to do two camera angles on here so you guys can kind of see what's going on. But that is the plan here is the full rack thus far. 
Be sure to uh, give me a thumbs up, hit subscribe, hit that bell, hit all guys. Leave me a comment, let me know what you guys think. Now there will not be a full moose. The customer just wants a rack. And uh, that's what we're doing. Now we will be doing something different here too. I might not show that whole process, but you guys will be able to see this fully complete. I'm going to have a nice board for the back for hanging. And I don't know, I might try to wrap this once you join together. Wrap this in some leather or something like that. Mount it to a nice piece of wood for the wall. But we'll see. We'll see before the video's over. So don't go anywhere. We're going to bust out those paints and uh, start bringing this piece to life. This is it. It's late, run on low sleep, but uh, I finally got that moose rack done. I wrapped that center with some nice deep brown, almost black leather that I had. We did a black walnut backing. It's hanging on this board that I mounted to the table. So it's not screwed to that, but these are together. Before you guys go I'll try to get this outside so you guys can actually uh, maybe see it in the daylight this is what the customer wanted moose rack they could hang on the wall so this was fun this was an awesome project fun car fun build really interested to know what you guys think Leave me a comment, give me a like, give me a follow, hit subscribe, and let's go outside and see what this thing looks like in daylight. Hey guys, check it out. Here's that rack outside. It's the next day. That last segment was last night, so I thought I'd get it out here. This bright spot is obviously from the sun shining. I was kind of hoping to catch it before the sun got up over here, but you guys can kind of see what's going on. This was a really fun project. Really interested to uh, hear what you guys think. Leave me a comment, give me a like, give me a follow, guys. Appreciate all of you that are members. You guys are awesome. Thank you to everybody that's been hitting subscribe. We've got a lot of new subscribers recently. Like I said, I'd love to see 30,000 subscribers in a year. So that's like another 15,000 subscribers we gotta get this year. So hopefully we can do it. You know, like the video, share, comment, do all that stuff. It helps the uh, channel grow, and I really, really do appreciate it. So hope you guys have an awesome day, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.